Hello YouTube, how y'all doing today? Today we're taking a look at a really cool open carry rig setup by Alps Outdoors. And that is the Talon Open Carry Holster. This is a retention holster with retention strap. I'll get into how that works in a minute. The Shield Binocular Carrier. It could also carry, you know, any types of equipment the size of this. You know, you, night vision, range finders, all that kind of stuff. And it is actually big enough that you could put a 6x6 six six armor panel in there. You know, if that's your thing. Uh, we have Molly type straps in the side. So I have a Mara knife one here. And a Baofeng GMRS Pro. We'll be doing a full review on this in the future. So keep an eye out on that. But I'll put links to all this stuff in the uh, description. And this is a Sig P322. So you get an idea of what, si what size handgun this will hold. So this is a really cool setup. Uh, the way it's designed here, it'll strap on your chest. The whole configuration. And I'll splice some video of that in here. And of course, you can also carry it strong side or cross draw, and I'll link some video of that in here. And you can see from the drawing sequences that this is a very fast holster to use and to draw from. Now the Ember hand warmer, and by the way, this sucker is warm in the wintertime. It's awesome. And the Shield binocular case are made out of uh, Alps Outdoors Dead Quiet Fleece. This is a super quiet and it's highly water repellent. It doesn't make a lot of jostling around sounds when you're using it. And we also have a nice big pocket right here. And this is a magnetic pocket on the uh, Ember hand warmer. And we got some ants floating around here. We don't want you in the video, guys. All right. So the way this retention system works is very simple. Pull this up here, flip it up. It's basically just a, like a cup, a pocket, I guess, and a, a male and female here. And it works very well. All you do, you want to take it off, you just grab a hold of it, pull it down, and release. And then you got easy, quick, easy access to your firearm. And we have a, a SIG 322 here with an easy shoot 2000 lumen light and laser. And we'll be doing a review on this as well in the near future. And then we just have an A2, uh, A1 bird cage on this thing. Okay. So you can run this with or without this strap. It's very easy to remove. If you want to take it off, you just unhook these guys from here. This will, whole thing will pull right up through here. Comes right out. Take our pistol out here. This is Velcroed on the inside. And now... It's an open top. Now, I, I carry it like this when I'm carrying it on my waistband. I use it like this. When I'm carrying it on the binocular holder horizontally, I do use that for maximum retention. And the 322, and you can see we have this flash hider on here. Now, the 322, even, with, you know, especially with the flash hider, this is a very large pistol. So you could easily fit something like a Glock 20, 10 millimeter in here, you know, something of that size. And this would be a fantastic setup in bear country for bear defense, trail defense, uh, hiking against mountain lions. You know, you could put a nice big handgun in there and uh, it works pr perfectly. Now, one thing about this light, you see the way I got a little bit of extension here. I can get my fingers right in there. And I really like that. Okay. Prop this up a little bit here so you could see it. Because of the light, I'm able to get my whole finger in there. Okay, if you don't have the light on it, it goes a little bit deeper. So, you know, since this is a universal holster design, you know, and then it's not quite as fast or easy to draw. And it also fits much more snugly with this light on it. So if you're going to use this, I do actually highly recommend using a good size weapon light with it. You know, about this size. You can see how big that is there. You know, Streamlight, Surefire. You know, all your various companies, Phoenix, top-end companies, make lights of approximately this size. So you pick your brand and you go with what you like. The way this is attached is actually very clever. Let me get the pistol out of here. Okay, so we have this little clip right here, this plastic clip. And this has got a little detent on it. You pop that, and it slides right in there out. Then you can take this. 
and you could use the same clip on the back side this is ambidextrous it's got the same hookups on every side it is fully ambidextrous and you could take this and you can run it on a plate carrier like this put this on here okay and you could see with the molly this is designed to go through it'll go through three but i recommend going through two rows so that you don't have tension on this out here so that side runs up through here then you run this side right through the holster like this and just snap the whole thing together and boom now you have a chest mounted holster on your molly just like that and this is a uh, plate carrier that i am testing for cv life also you know i'll put links for all this stuff in the description but that, that rides at a nice height. You know, it's uh, entirely usable where it is. And of course, you can also go horizontal. And I'll demonstrate that now as well. Okay, so to go horizontal, you're going to use these straps right here like this. Put them in here. We're left-handed, so we'll put them like this. Now you could go high or low, as high or low as you want. We'll just go right here for demonstration purposes. Go through two rows, as I said. Take our pistol out of here. Run it right through here. Now, this holster is made out of a nice Cordura nylon, and this is a very sturdy rubberized material. Okay, so now we got this attached on here nicely. Now, again, if you're going to wear it like this, I would recommend using the retention strap. And you can put it right here, right like that. And that fits on there really nicely. Let me don this guy and we'll show you how it looks. Okay, now one other thing I wanted to show you is you can incorporate all this right onto your plate carrier setup. This becomes like an admin pouch and radio holder and you can mount the pistol right here down low on your plate carrier and I'll show you all that right now Thanks for watching, folks. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Remind me out.